please be working. And now it's working again. Please, please, my audio visual sound gods out there, please let my microphone be working correctly. Or else I'm going to drown myself in this almost empty glass of red wine. Can I get a refill? Can I get a refill? I'll be right back. <laughs> so I'm dancing to my imaginary song. Okay, I got a refill of the wine. And I did a costume change because it didn't like the way that that gray was looking. It just, gray is like one of my favorite colors. It's totally <laughs> useless, but it wasn't doing much for me on camera. So, hi guys, welcome back. Thanks so much for joining me again and all the nonsense or all the really amazing shit that's always constantly happening. A few things that I want to talk about before we get right into it. Or I guess we're not getting right into it, right? Because if I want to talk about a few things, all right, whatever, I always digress. Anyway, I just want to first of all say thank you guys so much for the love, the support, everything that I'm getting in all directions. It's like I'm getting slapped in the face with a bunch of dicks from everyone. And I say that in like the best possible way. <laughs> it's a compliment. Not that that's something that, that I want. It doesn't fucking matter. What I'm saying is that I appreciate all the love that I'm getting from you guys. So thank you, thank you. Round of applause to every single one of you and even the haters out there and the wonderful trolls um, like via emails that I'm getting. I love you guys so much. You guys are very entertaining. That's my first of all, which would be my only all. So let's get right into it. Dick pics. No. Let me explain something to you guys where <laughs> you men as creatures, you are very visual, right? You guys love pictures, sexy pics, nude pics, whatever pics. You guys will just take it all. Where women, we tend to be, well, we're definitely more fickle creatures, that's for sure, but we need to have sex mentally we get turned on mentally before it's like visually is not gonna no and i will tell you from experience that a guy sending me an unrequested dick pic has literally made me in things with them there was a guy that pursued me it was like via social media and he was reaching out he was really trying attractive guy very successful in his own whatever industry he is in, extremely successful. And uh, we tried, he tried, he tried. I finally, after I think about six months, I finally gave him my number. Like it was so, I was super resistant. And yeah, anyway, so I finally gave him my number. And the first couple of times of communication, like we, it goes back and forth and everything's good. We've talked, we FaceTimed, everything's great. There hadn't been up to this point there had been zero conversation about i don't fucking know anyway and so there had been zero the conversation had not even escalated to the point where now we're like Ooh, what are you wearing? Ooh, daddy, what are you wearing? Ooh, mommy, tell me. You got them panties on that I like? No, none of that shit had, had happened, okay? So we were just getting to know each other, kind of feeling each other out. And at this point, I had been so resistant. You would think that he would, I don't know, maybe realize like he needs to tread carefully and kind of, I don't know, maybe that's why he sent me the picture because he thought he needed to impress me. I don't know. We were texting and I don't know, he was doing something. He was like, oh, I just got out of the shower. Like, oh, okay, I was like, well, you know, hit me later, whatever. And then boom, dick pic. Um, okay, did I ask for that? Because no, nice dick, but that doesn't turn me on. There might be some women out there that are, are turned on by the unrequested dick pic, but I'm going to tell you guys right now, the majority of women don't like an unsolicited dick pic, okay? And if they're asking you for a dick pic, I don't know. Like, I've never asked anyone for a dick pic, and I, I like to consider myself, I am... 
I'm a pretty horny. <laughs> I like sex. I really like the male body. I like a lot of things, but dick pics don't do it for me. In fact, they do the exact opposite of doing it for me. They can take me from like, I'm in, I'm heightened and I'm excited and I'm this and I'm that to like, if I had a fucking dick and it was hard, like I'd immediately, I would turn flaccid. That's not what you guys want to hear, but that's the equivalent for what it's like for a woman to receive a dick pic, especially one that we haven't asked for. If we get, if you ask for one, psh, send away, you know, fucking run for us, run, get some good angles, press against your stomach, your balls look, <laughs> you know, move the balls back out of the way. Your dick will look, will look a little bigger. Just some suggestions. If you do want to send a dick pic but think about why you're sending the dick pic right like the goal of sending the picture is to 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 turn on your your woman right like you want to you want to appeal to her and you want her to be excited by the thought of being with you that's the whole point of sending them let's let's think bigger let's be more creative because any joe schmo can send a fucking dick pic right be more creative and really pay particular attention to what kind of species you're dealing with, i.e. the woman. We are not turned on by that. Talk about what you want to do to us or what you can't wait to do. Don't tell me you're going to beat the pussy up. I'm sorry, that also. <laughs> like, if you, if you and I have yet to sleep together, you're telling me that you're going to beat my pussy up better than anyone's ever beat it up. Like, I'm sorry, I pass. That's also not going to do it for me. You can't wait to hold me. Or, you know, if you guys are already having sex and you want to turn around, my dick is so hard thinking about looking at your body tonight, or I'm so turned on thinking about licking your pussy tonight, or like touching you, or I can't wait to grab a hold of your body, you know, or I love the way you look at me. I love, like, there are so many things that you can say to your woman to make her turned on. Don't think about what turns you on. Think about what turns her on. Think about past conversations. There are definitely hints out there. Every woman drops those hints whether they try to or not. There's those, those inadvertent hints and then there's like, hey, motherfucker, please pay attention to me because I'm dropping some knowledge on you type of hints. Just try to to remember some past conversations that either A, you guys have had about one another, being with each other, B, you know, past relationships, if you guys have had those discussions, or even see conversations she's had in reference to her friends, or like some shit you guys have seen on TV, stuff that she's reacted positively to. Those are the types of things that you need to remember when you're texting or when you're communicating. And fuck, write your woman, like write her a handwritten letter. When was the last time you wrote a handwritten letter? I will tell you what, that is the biggest panty dropper ever because nobody writes letters anymore. Not a typed letter. I'm t and it's it doesn't matter how bad your handwriting then is and it could be three sentences i miss you i love your body i can't wait to be inside you i don't give a fuck if it's handwritten like it doesn't matter you can be fucking you could be straight up quoting like skinamax bad line like just the worst of the worst of the worst in dialogue. But if it's handwritten, all of a sudden, she's like, oh my God, look what he did. He gave me, this motherfucker cares. That's literally how it goes. We get so excited. We get so wet at the thought of you trying different things. It's so easy to send a text. It's so easy to send a dick pic. It takes zero creativity. Unless, oh, <laughs> I just thought of this crazy idea. Unless you like dress up your dick. But then that's just, see, that's where my mind goes. I'm super outrageous. In my head, I was like, oh, if you did, like you dressed up your dick every like a different day of the week. And like, I don't know. That... Hold on. <laughs> All right, you guys don't want to hear me swallow the wine. Hmm. Or do you? Okay. Anyway, the point of this is stop sending dick pics. Unless you're sending to a guy because you guys are visuals. So do whatever the fuck you want. But us women, we don't respond that way. And I will reiterate, and now if you've got a woman that she responds well to that or she has requested a dick pic, then it's a fucking free for all. But other than that, you stay so fucking clear of the dick pic. Stop it. Stop it. We don't give a fuck, okay? Because guess what? We don't care. We don't care. Congratulations. You got a big dick. 
Congratulations, you got a medium-sized dick. Congratulations, you got a pink dick. Congratulations, you got a black dick. It doesn't fucking matter. We don't give a fuck. Tell us what you're going to do with that dick. How about that? Tell us what you plan on doing to us with that dick. Or what you'd like us to do to that dick. Don't just show us the fucking dick. Show us some damn creativity. All right, (laughs) that's it. Make sure you guys subscribe. Hit that like button. Go to magicsexandcoffee.com. I'm going to keep drinking, and I love you all so much. Yeah, that's it. Bye, guys.